I thought I'd make a video. It is April the 29th, 2016. It's going on 11 o'clock at night. Not at night. <laughs> it's in the morning. And it's a cold, rainy, dreary, gray morning here by Lake Michigan. I'm sitting in my main study writing in my diary. I'm on page 365. Tomorrow is the last day of April. I already got my May diary already. My May diary. On the 19th of May, my wife and I celebrate 37 years of being married. Here's a wedding picture. When we got married, this is when we were dating. This is our wedding photo. I keep that on my desk. So yeah, so I'm sitting here and I've been reading Open City by Teju Cole. Uh, it says here on the back, a haunting novel about identity, dislocation, and history. Taiju Cole's Open City is a profound work by an important new author who has much to say about our country and our world. Along the streets of Manhattan, a young Nigerian doctor named Julius wanders reflecting on his relationships, his recent breakup with his girlfriend, his present, his present, his past, he encounters people from different cultures and classes who will provide insight into on his journey, which takes him from him to Brussels, to Nigeria, of his youth, into the most unrecognizable facets of his own soul. It says here, name one of the best books of the year by the New York Times Book Review, The New Yorker, The Atlantic, The Economic, Economist, Newsweek, The Daily Beast, The New Republic, The New York Daily News, Los Angeles Times, the Boston Globe, the Seattle Times, and it goes on and on. It was a finalist for the National Book Critics Circle Award. I'm really enjoying it. I, I came across this book on uh, on YouTube, and I I ordered it in the mail. I also been uh, I read. I got this book Wednesday at the Book Nook. I had a cover some for somebody at the library used bookstore, and I found this book uh, by Roberto Bellino. These are his short stories, The Return. I read a short story out of here. And I've been still reading Paris Vagabond. I'm almost done with this. Uh, I'm really, like, I keep I keep repeating myself, but... This is really a great book. Uh, I got this biography in the mail yesterday. Uh, Lecture is my beat. The life of James Langland, Lag Laglin, publisher of the New Direct New Directions. Uh, this is by Alan S. McNevin. I got this. Uh, New Directions is one of my favorite publish, publishing companies, and if I see any book published by New Directions, I buy it. New Directions published Henry Miller, uh, Lawrence Durrell, uh, it just goes on and on. They uh, published William Carlos Williams, uh, Herman Hess, uh, Ezra Pound, uh, Louis, George Lewis Boards uh, just goes on and on so I got that in the mail and I've been reading uh, The Other Paris by Luc Sente reading a uh, book of poetry uh, Ariel Poems by Sylvia Path been reading this this morning and that's what I've been reading as far as I've been reading this too, the treatise on true theology 
by Franciscus Julius, who lived in the 16th century. So I'm reading these books, and I haven't got back into Gloria. Kind of like, I tend to look at books as a long river of, of words, a flow of words, and they're all connected. And But I'll get back to Gloria. I tend to just read wherever my spirit leads me. So, but yeah, I really like this book and uh, really like this book too. Just great books. So yeah, that's what I'm reading and uh, writing in my diary and just going through time. Tomorrow I volunteer again at the library book nook and I got books set aside there I'll talk about next time. So that's all I gotta say. Uh, so yeah, I'm start reading this and reading Open City. So until next time, bye.